LG G71, LG embraces Android One in all its unmodded glory. It's easy to see why phone buyers are attracted to Android One, the purest version of Google's mobile OS. For years, manufacturers have been adding their own layer onto Android, for better or worse, so it's always refreshing to see it all laid bare on a phone that's sporting decent specs. And that's what we have here with the LG G71, a phone that's very similar to the LG G7 Think but with a much leaner OS. The phone was revealed at IFAR 2018 and is certainly a handset for the UI minimalist crowd. The LG G71 release date and price was unfortunately not revealed at IFAR 2018, but we will update when we get more information. Here's hoping that the price in the US is a good deal cheaper than what the LG G7 think was. This was one thing that stopped up from really liking that phone. Like the LG G7 think, we may be writing that phrase a lot, the LG G71 is an all glass phone, with a polished metal rim disrupting this aesthetic. It's slim and certainly premium looking. The back of the phone is frosted glass, which is a nice touch. On the front is an 8MP wide angle, f1.9, lens, which is cradled by the now obligatory notch, and this found above the 6.1 inch QHD plus, 3120 by 1440, super bright display. The display sports a 19.5 to 9 full vision screen ratio and is certainly enough real estate to watch movies, it also supports HDR10. The button of the screen nudges into quite a small bezel. Flip it over and there's a 16MP standard angle, f1.6, lens and the Android 1 logo, it's Android 8.1 Oreo on board. The sides of the LG G71 are populated by volume controls and a power button, and the bottom of the device has a USB-C slot, 3.5mm jack, something we are still pleased about, and a speaker grill. It's the bottom of the LG G71 that reveals the phone's audio goodness. The speaker is LG's boombox speaker setup. The phone has been designed to house a resonance chamber, so when it's put on a hard surface and a tune is pumping out of it, the sound is bigger and more expansive than of a normal tinny phone speaker. We tried it and even in the lofty confines of a convention center, it sounded richer than we were expecting. Then there's the 3.5mm jack. This is important as there is also a 32-bit hi-fi quad DAC in the device which will work well with any half-decent pair of headphones. Then there's virtual 3D sound that is said to be able to produce up 7.1 quality audio goodness. We didn't try this out but the keyword here is virtual so don't go expecting miracles, though this is a much more audio-friendly handset than many others out there. The LG G71 sports a Qualcomm Snapdragon 835 chip, with 4GB of RAM and 32GB of internal storage, there's a Microsd slot too so you can whack the storage up to 2TB if you really want to. Eagle-eyed reader will note this is less on board storage than what's on offer with the LG G7 Think and the chipset is not the top of the class 845, that can be found in that phone, too. RAM has pushed down to 4GB, too, which does irk. It's got a 3000mAh battery but if you do start to run low, Qualcomm's quick charge tech should give you the boost you need. All of this is powering Android One, which is a great, simple experience. Free from bloatware and bespoke overlays, it's a really pleasant phone experience. This is LG's first Android One phone and there seems to be a trend for most manufacturers to offer a version of one of their handsets and we hope this continues. As it's Oreo 8.1, there's a ton of background optimization done by the OS and a load of safety features, courtesy of Google Play Protect, to make sure what you're downloading won't hard your phone. 